What's up guys, Lee Fry here. Welcome back to the channel. And today, I'm gonna be showing you guys a video I put together uh, displaying a cinematic food sequence. So, make sure you guys stay tuned. Do not go anywhere. What's up guys, welcome back. So like I said in the intro, I'll be showing you guys a cinematic food sequence that I put together. And first off, I wanna talk about where I got the inspiration to make this video. A YouTuber that I watched that I have talked about on this channel before, Patrick Tommaso, uh, made a video discussing how there's a lot of food videos, channels out there that really don't make their movies look cinematic, look like a movie, looks more like a commercial, not really any shadows, no depth, nothing like that. So he made a whole video discussing that and talking about how he got that, got his inspiration. So I'm gonna put a link to his channel to that video in the description below. So you guys, if you want, you can check it out. Um, but that's kind of where I got the inspiration to make this. I watched his video and I was like, you know what, that'd be kind of cool. So uh, my son sometimes tells me he wants to help me cook. Uh, Sometimes he doesn't, sometimes he doesn't. Sometimes he does, sometimes he doesn't. If you have kids, you would understand that. So, um, but this day he wanted to help. So he loves spaghetti. He basically the main thing he enjoys eating. So I had him prepare that. Obviously I helped him out, but I was videotaping it throughout you know, the whole process. So that's how I put this video together. I was very happy with how it came out. I also shot this uh, sequence with my Canon EOS R that if you don't already follow my channel, you know that I traded in for what I'm showing on now, which is the Sony a7S III. And I want to do another kind of video like this using the Sony a7S III because I think this camera will do very good with this because it's a very, it's a lot of low light. There's, you don't use a lot of light for this. Um, basically all I use for light is my, the overhead lights and then I use a small LED light, you know, to kind of light the background. So I think the Sony a7S III would do very good with that since it is such a low light beast. All right, anyways guys, so without further ado, I'm gonna let you guys go, let you guys view uh, the sequence I put together. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'm just gonna end it right now. As far as what I'm gonna be talking, just show you the video and the video's gonna be over. I don't know why I went through all that, but anyways, um, I hope you guys enjoy it. If you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, leave a comment. Let me know if there's anything you wanna see and enjoy the video. Have a good one. Mm -hmm. 